So you might be in a position where applications are just not sending out the verification code. So what does this mean? Well, certain apps that maybe require you to log in with your account or whatever the case is, they may not be sending you a verification code to actually go ahead and type in to verify that it's your account. Now, these verification codes are usually sent via text messaging. So if they go ahead and basically send it to you via text message, that is basically where you want to go. So whether you're on Android, iPhone, whatever phone, it doesn't matter, make your way over to your messages of your application, and you may be able to see that specific security code sent to you. Now, from my experience, that's usually what I had to do because sometimes I will not be notified of that specific notification. It's very strange. Sometimes it happens, sometimes it doesn't. It requires me to make my way over to my messaging application, and I should be able to find it there. So that is basically the first thing I'd recommend doing, just going through, opening up your messaging application, and you should be able to find it there. Now, if there's a specific application that you know you are using and it's causing the issue, what I would recommend doing is finding that application. So let's say TikTok, for example. What you want to do is you want to make your way over to your App Store or your Google Play Store and just search up the TikTok application. So find TikTok and see if there's an update available for that application. Chances are, I will say there's probably an update for it. And all you want to do there is just update that app. I'm going to be honest, that is probably going to fix it for a majority of people out there too. And that's what I would recommend doing as well. Now, if that's still not working, finally, probably the, one of the last things, if you don't, if you, there's no issues with your phone, like you can reboot or whatever, the main issue could be with those servers of that specific application. So what I would recommend doing is going to websites like downdetector.com or some other website. I'm not sponsored by these guys. I talk about them a lot because I like their website, but whatever website doesn't matter. What I would recommend doing is scrolling through on their site and just seeing if a lot of complaints are happening. So you can see if you have AT&T, that probably means that there could be some issues. Like if it's, you know, current, that probably means there's, there's some issues. So that might be why you're not getting text. Instagram, same exact thing. If you're trying to get, you know, logged into Instagram and they're sending you codes, it might mean that there's some issues on their servers. So you're going to have to wait it out. So just go through here, find these specific applications that are causing you issues. If they're one of the top ones, then that typically means, like if they're like this, then that means, yeah, there's probably an issue. But if it's not like this and if it's just, you know, very common, maybe like a straight line kind of, then that might mean that there might be some other issues. You can try updating your phone, trying, to, you know, some other ways to log in, but it kind of covers it up. If you have any other thoughts or questions, let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button. That me so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out, till then.